I've been thinking about you all so much. Hoping you all had a wonderful December and you got a good start to the new year already. Um, I am taking you on the road with me this morning to the latest doctor's appointment. Um, I'm hoping your year has started off a hell of a lot better than ours has. Um, I thought I would give you just a little life update of what's going on and and kind of why you're seeing older material on the channel and then at that point it's not I didn't even date it right <laughs> um, so Christmas was a long time ago but uh, we had a good Christmas other than the fact that my son or no sorry my husband we, we drove all the way over. Um, we had a little hiccup in the plans. They were called off and put back on again. So we made it over there by Christmas Eve. <clears throat> but on the ride over, uh, my husband, we drove separately so we'd have enough room in cars and uh, had to cat all that. So we um, get to my folks and it's about seven hour, eight hour, ride away uh, with a kid having to stop at every city to use the bathroom it's um, and maybe it's more like eight or nine hours maybe ten so we got there and my husband said I don't feel well put him up in a hotel for a couple nights then he came home we came home Uh, just before New Year's and then my son got sick <clears throat> so ended up in the ER with him um, you know first couple days of the new year and he's gonna be fine uh, just, just illness related and then my daughter got sick and then uh, about a week after, well no, I guess about three days after the ER, um, my son had a doctor's appointment. We go to the doctor's, the doctor says, okay, we good, just it'll run its course, okay. The next day, I cannot walk. I was bedridden. The day after that was supposed to be my final PT. I have been going to PT since May. I'm ready to be done with PT. I had gone three weeks just fine without PT. I have my rescue exercises for when my back gets really stiff. My hips were locked, painful, lower back like in the sacrum area can't walk without a lot of pain still that way today so that's why we're going to the doctor so or well the PT so more PT in my future um, so what is happening then on the house well nothing and it's a disaster still and the more I try to clean out that area that I was working on, the more people see, oh, hey, that's free space, and they move stuff to that area. So it's all, it's all um, work in progress, but it, nothing's getting worked on it now. So, because uh, I've been bedridden for the last two days at PT three days ago and I've been bedridden the past two days. So, um, what I'm doing is I'm going through um, old videos that I've recorded and just because I had initially hoped to have like a, a two video a week schedule, but that just isn't something that I can do easily with 
our family's dynamics. So I'm going back through and finding old videos on my phone of things that I've been working on, like um, boxes I've cleared out of the shop last year, or um, just just different things. I do have my q and I'm going to post that even though it's unfinished. Um, so um, for a while it's just going to be throwback videos until I can actually stand upright and twist and um, stand for longer than two minutes and um, ensure that I don't fall. Um, but because that, that's like the last thing I need. But between all of the medical stuff and then um, our hot water heater springing a leak and flooding our, our laundry room, <clears throat> our washing machine on the fritz, our kitchen sink leaking all over our floor. It has been a trial and I have not handled it very gracefully in most uh, instances, but I'm, I'm really, really ready to say, can we just fast forward 2024, celebrate Christmas again, and then move on to 2025, please? <laughs> um, so we've, we've uh, that's where we're at. And the, uh, I'm gonna try to keep interesting things here. I may, uh, do a video if, if I have to sit then I may do a video about my new planner uh, system that I have that was working really well and <clears throat> so that might be beneficial on here um, and uh, that's gonna be it for a while we're just gonna kind of hunker and do what we can do um, and I'm just I'm so excited to get back to cleaning stuff out I cannot wait so uh, that's kind of the update from here. I, I surely hope with all my guts and my heart that you guys are having a much better year. Uh, a start, it is just, it's our turn. <laughs> I know that there has to be thousands and thousands of people having much better years than we are and that's I, that's the only thing that's really giving me hope is that somewhere somebody is having a really really good day and I am just thankful for that um, but it'll get better uh, gotta have the bad parts so you don't know how good the good parts are or at least something like that <laughs> so anyway um, I'm almost to my PT and I'm gonna let you go um, have a really really great day it's supposed to we had a doozy of a windstorm here. Uh, we didn't lose power. A lot of places around the Seattle area lost power. Uh, we didn't lose power. Lights flickered all day while I was laying in bed and my daughter was sick trying to take care of my son. Um, but the snow levels come down. We do actually have some snow now. Um, and uh, to look at. We don't get snow where we are, but we have it to look at. And um, we're supposed to get snow possibly tomorrow. So I'm really hoping that my PT can get me straightened out enough so that I can go out in it and let my son play in it because snow and wind are his favorite and his best. <laughs> and he absolutely loves them. So uh, we got him some of those snowball makers for Christmas. So <clears throat> it's time. <laughs> anyway, you guys have a great uh, week. Uh, you'll find a new video up on the blog today. I cleared out vases. I just picked out a box, threw it in the back of my car, let destiny take me on a decluttering adventure. So, hope you have a good one. Take care. Bye-bye.